Welcome to Remix the Verse, guys. Thank you so much for tuning in. We're going to start straight off with the art sneak peek. More of what you want, less of what you don't. No, no, uh, but we do have this cool new uh, footage on the new bounty system that's going to be coming out soon in 2.2. Also, 2.2 on the PTU. If you've been invited, good for you. That means you've been active in the community. If you haven't, well, start playing so that people can actually be able to submit content. <laughs> um, so the bounty system is going to be pretty simple. You do bad things. You shoot people for no reason other than you just want to see their space pixels explode. Uh, you'll get a bounty. People will be able to pull that like a mission be able to find you, yes. kill you, and get money for it. So it's going to be exciting. It's going to drive a lot of PvP. Uh, also, the griefing that's been happening is going to be toned down a bit because now people actually have a reason to go find these people, these no-gooders, and be able to put them in their place. So that's going to be really exciting. Also on the 2.2 is the Sabre, the ship that everybody's been waiting for. I know I have. I think that ship is gorgeous. It flies horribly, but it looks beautiful. So <laughs> on the PTU, go fly it. It's gorgeous, but don't expect too much from it. Also. Mantis chain guns can be loaded with almost 35 millimeter caliber ammo, so that's kind of overpowered, but hopefully a CIG fixes that soon, knock on wood. Um, but other than that, there's really not much else to talk about. We're just going to go straight into the interviews and then jump straight on to uh, studios from around the verse. So stay tuned, guys. It's going to be a couple of minutes. It's going to be a wild ride, so have some fun, and then comment in the section when the video is done, and I will see you guys next week. Hi guys, this is Sunny Santa Monica to try to get PTU pushed out as well as set playtest up and get all those bugs and all those crashes and stuff kind of like given out to my team. Calyx is also working on um, the Caterpillar recently. I have good luck working on the Caterpillar. Currently wrapping up the Heavy Marines. Have a good day, guys. Hey guys, Jake Ross here, uh, public crash handler. Um, but yeah, that's all I got for you this guy this week, guys. Thanks. See you around. Hi everyone, welcome to the UK. We, we've got someone on ship balancing full time now, um, so you know where we've just been duplicating stats for components and things like that. We've got the Idris in there, which is quite exciting for some of the guys that have been doing play tests. We've been it's flying around shooting in. people in turrets. Moby Glass is another thing. We've got the squadron forty. See you in the verse. Thanks everyone. Hey everyone, Brian Chambers from the Frankfurt office. Uh, um, um, bugs for Crusader and. A arena commander maps, um, player oxygen consumption, so designing quantum and interdiction. Uh, um, um, on cinematics, see you next week. Quality insurance, we're making sure that the game's fun and that it's working properly. We yeah, pretty much. We're the ones who, you know, we get we get dirty in the, in, into the dirty code, and then, you know, hopefully it's clean by the time it passes through us and get to the fans. But obviously, you know, they're going to run into a certain thing. You know, get the, get the public's feedback on it, and, you know, that way I could jump in the code myself and say, hey, you know what? They're really right about this. I should probably, you know, turn this into a bug or something. Yeah! No! <laughs> I'm your host, Community So I started and did not know how much I enjoyed it until I did. And I've been at it ever since. Uh, I've worked in the gaming industry. I've worked in electronic arts. Uh, I've worked on a couple smaller indie titles. And I do have a fair knowledge of game design itself. Uh, I actually teach in a game design degree. So... Uh... <laughs> Oh, you're actually moving me around. Dude, try to move me back. What are you doing to me, man? 